where we want to start who wants what were we going to talk about i forgot already of course you have of course you have i'm so pissed off at zoom fucking war books guards and troop formation fucking war books guards and troop formation <laughs> combination thereof lions and tigers and bears oh my okay <laughs> All right, this is Don. This is playing Gun Muse on Kingdom 592 with Creed, also in 592, and Arkin from 592, who is also broadcasting from home. All right, how's everybody doing? Oh, good. Okay, so we're going to talk about war books, guard weapons and formations because there's a combination thereof especially with the new guard cards that you guys just saw put i was already working on as i'll show you on my account i was working on an infantry formation because you know i i think the uh, way i put it to the developers was you know rock paper limp noodle was the way the freaking stuff worked and so they gave us a guard card for giving infantry some capability. Uh, but infantry is a large, and, and they, what they did was they removed from the war books, right? You saw them, wait a minute, wrong freaking, I, I forgot to move this. War books, the library, they removed from the infantry on the odd guards where we had the above 50%, below 40%. If you got more than 50% of your troops in the war books, then you got so much more extra damage that used to be in the war books. They took that away, and luckily yesterday on day one, I did get the new guard card. And excuse my misclicking, guys. I hate whatever they changed. This is now so overly sensitive. I have about an eighth inch of a strip to actually not click something uh it is horrendous okay so aramis <clears throat> and they put into the fifth talent on aramis grant your infantry the block effect blocking 20 percent damage received and increasing survivability and coordination and coordination with other units when both attacking and defending okay we don't know what and coordination means. It's an undefinable word because it can mean whatever you want it to after the fact. So whatever we do our testing on later and find out it does, they're going to say, oh, yeah, that's what we wanted it to do. Uh, increasing survivability, well, that's admitting that the damn things keep getting killed. But I don't believe this is a good wall guard right now. Okay, so no. I'm not playing around with it. I don't I've had a few people it. ask me if it should be used as a war guard. And it can be, but I don't think that that's an effective place to use it. You definitely got to combine it with your war books if you're going to try it. They can't be the wall guard alone, but you got to go into your war books and redirect uh, energy towards your infantry. Because in your war books, you can still upgrade... You can still direct, where is it, indestructible, no, uh, sacrifice. There we go. Your infantry goad the enemy and attacking them instead and take will take 35% of the damage. And then we go to our T11s, and they absorb 13.75% more damage. That makes them a little stronger than a T12 in absorbing damage. The thing on the T12s, I had a developer send me a great big long letter that said they're not really making the T13 stronger than the T12s. They're sliding the T12s down, and they're putting the T13s back on the top. Uh, and that seems to be – that letter I got three months ago, uh, and that seems to be true because we've gotten a lot of reports that everybody's starting to kick the C40s as butts when they weren't before. And like I said, there, there, was, a, there was a table – and I'm using my hands, but I don't have any camera up today. There was a table, top and bottom. All they did was keep the same table and slide it down. Now, the advantage to the – I don't want to say the T-13s aren't more powerful. That's not what I'm saying. Because in the War Academy, oddball troops get damage. So T-13s have damage added to them while their base stats have been slid down. Their damage numbers are slid up by War Books. 
Okay, yeah. so G thirteen are stronger, but they're stronger because of your war books. They're not stronger because they're T thirteens. T thirteens are old T twelves with damage added to them. So they're dangerous as shit. They're just T twelves are like T tens are now. Eh, who cares? Uh yeah. And that gets us into the two tier formations that everybody's starting to starting to wonder about and they're wondering when are you gonna get a calculator for two tier formations? I had to get a this and I told everybody before, I knew they weren't done because I know what it was broken. Uh so I'm just sitting here twiddling my thumbs waiting for them to get things up to snuff. If they would actually follow the ambassador program interview that I had where they wanted to invite me in before, we'd have had this stuff done a long time ago. We could have fixed a bunch of it instead of waiting until it comes out here, me demonstrating what's broke, and then going back and fixing it again. Seems like you're spending twice the budget trying to get things right. Uh, I understand balance and where it needs to be. The uh... Well, yeah, I've been testing out different stuff for ages. And I, <clears throat> when everybody said, oh, stats have gone out the window when the guards originally changed i knew that that wasn't going to be the end of it that they were going to have to start introducing stuff back into it so i've been referring to the war books and the guards for quite a few months now but they keep changing stuff so every time i think i know what i'm doing something's changed whether it's a wording or a percentage or whatever um and obviously we had a conversation yesterday about how we think that the war books need to be set up with the new guards and the new formations. And I think that we're onto something pretty good. Yeah, it's, I, I, it's the, the way, I guess the way to... It brings stats back into it as well. The uh, Yeah, the stats are there. It was always, they, they divided it into two places. And where I think the breaking part is, at least right now, current match cap, is if you're under 400,000 on your March cap, the guards are very, 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 very important. If yeah. you're above 400,000, the stats start to gain power. And the guards that you were using pre 400%, 400K, you would change to a guard that says more troop than guard damage. You know, there's guards that say increases guard damage. We'll use those guards under 400K and then use the troop ones above 400K. The uh, is about where we are right now, I think. Yeah. I'm, just, I'm just buffing my account up. <laughs> it's yeah. getting close to reset, huh? I was like, oh shit, I've still got a couple of things to do. <laughs> We're gonna have yeah, to I, task. I, 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 Sorry. I, I, I forget. Yeah, I forgot, I forgot to uh, enhance my weapons yesterday. Uh, that's a daily thing. Got to go in and enhance those weapons every day now. And that's where, <laughs> and the reason I was is we're in the – so I'm in. I'm looking at the guard weapons now. Okay. Uh, this is one of the things, and I got to thank uh, uh, Dark Mystic for pointing it out because I, I completely missed this thing. And that was where I went into the home weapons, and I hone. Nope, not, not the right place. I enhance. And it doesn't say it now, but when I was doing that, and you saw, you know, rewind the video just a little bit, guys, and you saw, say, my total progress in percentage, I can swap out distance health for troop health when I go blow gold and find a golden troop health and insert it. But I got to go blow gold to do that and maintain my percentage of progress. All the enhancement dailies. So if I get this all the way to 100% all the way over, I can swap that 100% stat for any stat I want to. I can go put troop load in there because KR is coming up and just sit there and cycle, cycle, cycle until I get a bunch of troop load and I steal everybody's RSS in one, one hit, right? Uh, but you got to get all that. So you got to go in here daily to get that work done. Uh, that is... A great way to and, – and the best thing is is plan ahead on the gold spin days and do that and get some of that other loot and start combining events with that, a little bit of plan ahead. Uh, where are we going to get Arkin in here, man? He's just sitting over there breathing. <laughs> what, what do I get to kill now? Fucking, fucking talk while you're going. <laughs> I've, uh, I'm talking to Stimchek, my new buddy. I love Stimchak. He's my favorite. Uh, that's bizarre. He is. He's my favorite. He knows. Isn't it. he part? 
Isn't he part of the reason you don't play our kingdom anymore? No, he's not. <laughs> Lost so King is. Not. Lost King is. He's oh, never, okay. Stim, Stim Tech's never wound me up. It's always just been a bit of banter. Yeah. So it's a race thing. It's because Lost King is Asian. I don't know if a Lost King's Asian. I do. I can tell just by talking to him. <laughs> yeah. I'm a greedy little fucker. Oh, there I don't know whether he's in oil or not. I have no idea. Oil. <laughs> <laughs> well, okay, so we'll bring up with some bringing up Kingdom Green No, let's not. Reagan. Can we? Let's not get sidetracked to start off with. Right. Let's yeah, yeah, do. Yeah. Let's do the important stuff first. So yesterday we were talking about how to have our war book set up. Okay. So, so let's. We got, a, we, got a, we got a forty war book combo. All right. Now <coughs> it's not just war books. It's war books, airship. And your guard weapons, and then you got to plan your stats out. Okay, so yes. the, if you've gone back through any of the video, the, the 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 single march videos that we've done, there's a reason for the single march thinking. In order, you know, if you know you're not going to be one of these guard tower guys that spends you know 800 bucks a month, you're, then you're going to want to be a one march guy. So being a one march guy is much cheaper play than it's ever been before, uh, and We've got, and we've got enough influence now that people are listening to us that we've got deals that are coming out to even cut their costs on that. We're getting the app gallery stores to start paying for you guys to play again. Uh, just like we did during the summer, the new one's coming. Watch out for that, guys. It's going to be awesome. Uh, and so in the Hall of War, we're going to Library of War, distance has more damage to it, cheaper. And you get that leg of yep. damage up, 40 points of damage. Because Arkham was actually asking about this the other day. He's like, where the hell is that one little old clown getting 40 more damage than I am? He stacked his troop health. Uh, this this leg up here, you don't have to wait for those other legs. He stacked that one. And it gave him 40 extra damage on his distance. Calvary is the hardest to get up there. That's your engine leg, all right? Uh, because these damn scripts are insanely hard to get. The... In New Kingdoms. Old Kingdoms, you were given a lot of this stuff. Uh, and yeah. then when you look at the war books, there is now, there wasn't before, but there is Calvary damage. Yeah. The, where was it? Uh, da, 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 deal 3% of damage, your attack power minus the enemy's attack power. So there's a clause on that. So if I want to engage that clause and have a really fast attack Calvary march, I'm going to have to go down to my guard weapons and do what we were just talking. That's why we were talking about that. I'm going to go over here and I'm going to start stacking cavalry attack in all eight slots at max 100%, right? And that's going to give me 4,000% more cavalry attack because I stacked it in my guard weapons. And that means I'm probably going to outperform most of my enemies who haven't stacked cavalry attack. But remember, the damage leg is harder to obtain. So you need to so get that from the steel. Uh, oh, no, that's right. defense, isn't it? The steel resolve. But we have a lot of under C-35s and C-30s who are doing the cavalry because it's it's e it's the easier of the two guard. You can get two guard marches for them. Yeah. So you get guard bonuses. You get two marches of cavalry attack. They That's when they're going to go in here. They're going to get their stuff, but then they need to stack the stats from the weapon honing. They need to really focus on getting a, 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 a cavalry attack on all eight slots that's purple and making that thing go and then accelerating it every day to 100 percent plus a troop attack because remember that it's all it does say right there all benefits engage so that does troop attack troop important attack. troop attack might matter a little bit yeah troop attack's uh, important so like if one of your good friends gives you a title that takes away your troop attack that sucks oh yeah just like when one of your friends gives you a title where it you takes longer to train your troops peasant I didn't even look at it, guys. You... <laughs> Apparently, I had no dick. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. Arkin, do you realize that your, your name says Arlen and that I'm going to call you that forever now? Arlen. Hey, Arlen. We'll just, we'll just shorten it Arlen. <laughs> what up, Harry? Ah, uh, thank you. Yeah. <laughs> 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 uh... <laughs> Okay, right, back to the important stuff. 
<laughs> it's so easy to get sidetracked. Anyway, we we think that basically whatever march you're running, that you need to have a bit of infantry in there, and that you need to have the um, first three infantry war books maxed as well. Unless you're working on a forty book baseline, which is what me and Gunn have worked out to be like the minimum. Yeah, we figured out uh, for for an optimum damage, forty books on the war books things. Uh, if you're gold buying them instead of getting the fast things, uh, if you got the RSS form, is about seven thousand per book plus whatever it takes to get those books. I highly suggest if you're starting a new kingdom, on the daily deals when for the I think it's a nine dollar pack on one day where it gives you five hundred war books, just start stockpiling them, guys. One 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 a week, and by the time you really need them, two months later they're there at a big uh, yeah bonus event because the Our, our 50% of it took away the 50% growth, All right? So we don't have the 50% of it in 592 right now. I, we don't know if that's a bug because it's in older kingdoms, but I suspect that it was one of those things where they said, well, in older kingdoms, anybody under C35 is a new player, and therefore they can have the 50% as a speed-up benefit to help older kingdoms uh, because we've got some of the biggest kingdoms – that have ever played this game, you know, whose players are quitting. This was their last KVK this last Saturday. Uh, they're just they're just done, and we're we're going with it. We've got our rollout for next KVK. Uh, we don't know if they listen to us, uh, but we appreciate the one other <laughs> new kingdom. Where is it? Uh, they got our matchups in here somewhere. And this is why we're talking about this: is we actually want. Crown Invasion. We want the other guys to know what we know, because when we roll over your ass like you weren't even there, not that we didn't help you out. All right. So, because right now Kingdom 508, the oldest kingdom, doesn't even have a king. We are one. Join us, K477. Uh, in other words, they got owned. And 590, you got Russians in there, so I know you're not being run right. Yeah, but those yeah. matchups can change. Those matchups can change at the last minute. They love to do it. The uh, as it sits, uh, the expertise here, and, and but to be fair, we know that they put win loss ratios in the matchups now. We yeah. have never won a KVK, so we're gonna be in that ratio. I don't know if they put number of palaces one in the ratio or number of kingdoms one. So if we go rolling through these guys and go win three three palaces in one day, uh, which is kind of a serious possibility, uh, I I really suspect that 508 and 592 are going to be fighting for 590's palace. The uh, because they're run by Russians, and we are experts at killing Russians. The uh, no one. Uh, hey, don't bring me it. into that. I have killed no one. And I love the Russians. Oh, My alliance right. is full of Arkin, lovely, How many lovely Russians, Russians have you killed in the last six months? Six months? Oh yeah. Let's let's add five three three into that. Seventeen we... million. <laughs> that's that's probably the noise. Huge that's... argument with two Russian women in KC the other day. Because they didn't understand my sense of humor. I called one a pirate hooker. <laughs> so it was, it was bad. So I hit everything. I burned the entire eye. Can't seems, stand Russians. Seems reasonable. And then they, what they tell you is, I'm not Russian. I just speak. Don't care. Now you're Russian. You're dead. Speak Russian. You are Russian. Dead. That's the way it works. Distributive property. I, I think in five three three they went. It was like we'll kill your mothers with baseball bats. No, and then I, bad. and no, and then bad. I, I, I dubbed that little area like ten days later the gum used ghost town because no one was left. No one was farming. No one was there. And then in 592, the Russians were setting up a bot farm. And up until about a week ago, nobody was selling RSS in this kingdom because we killed everybody. <laughs> you, you couldn't buy a piece of wheat to save your life. The, uh, Not that we tried. <laughs> yeah. You're right. So we're <laughs> – not that we're trying. The uh, well, G 
GOG is doing good to make it we don't need it. To be honest, the, the I, I used to run farms in every previous kingdom. This is the only kingdom I've never run a farm in. Uh, the uh, I, I built two farms just to keep them somewhat alive and use them as blockers for some events. But I didn't build 100 farms because I don't like map manipulators. Uh, and we're not manipulating the map with our dead castles, farm castles. We're literally filling up our hive. So that is our map. We're not filling up places we don't own or control or none of that shit. I just want to make it take five seconds longer so that I have five seconds to kick your ass because the interface of Guns of Glory has been shit here lately. Oh, it's I fucking need... terrible. The button overlay is fucking murderous. Rallies, I've never seen anything like it. How can you I'm, I'm, fuck I'm... up something that's already right? Yeah, there's nothing wrong. What, 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 I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to put it on film here so everybody knows what I'm talking about here. I'm going to go to members. You mean they changed it to 3D and it had less detail? Yeah, that's it. It's there. There's something. The thing is, though, like on the um on the test server, there was no fucking problems like at all. So I don't know if it's because it's being distributed across so many accounts or not. Like I don't understand it because I didn't have any of those issue issues at all. It was really smooth. It was like nice to navigate. All the colors were nice and bright. It's fucking disappointing. For sure. I, I I think the the nice thing has been that the rules now you know I, so that the rumors don't spread because rumors man this is like a sewing circle in this this gaming community <laughs> the uh you know the the rule the it's because nobody con- gets out very much <laughs> we're all at home playing fucking gog <laughs> the, 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 <laughs> the open the open combat portion of this has worked out great and everybody goes well if I read your rules right then by the rules, no one can ever hit anybody. I was like, by the rules, that would be what happens. But it said, there's always somebody who thinks they're sneaky. And by the rules, you have every right to just smack the crap out of them, and the community can't say that you didn't have that right. Yeah, but so they you're... do, and that's that's half the problem, isn't it? Well, we have that problem here because I've got the 312 guys and the 362 guys and the 533 guys who all... You know, every time I move the projects forward that we do for Guns of Glory for the videos and stuff, I, I abandon the old kingdom and move to the next one. And then for some reason... Well, I mean, goes, when we're going we back... Ran him, we ran him out of this last one, and they're, they're still I... trying to run me out of this one. The thing is, I don't... You, from months and months and months prior, you, you know, you always wanted to do this, like, test kingdom. You knew roughly what kingdom you were going to go to. You talked about going to 600 for ages, but it was taking a really long time to come around. So everybody knew that you were going there. Everybody knew the reason why you were going there, why the other YouTubers were joining you. So it's not like it was ever a surprise when you wanted to take the reins a little bit as you wanted it as a tester kingdom. We've got about $30,000 in this kingdom. It was, you know, it was pretty publicized. Yeah. It, so for people I, to turn around and say, like, oh, well, who the fuck are you to do this? Well, why did you come here? You, you knew. Well, and they didn't get the concept that uh, it's. Yeah, I, I, they didn't get the concept that uh, I, I, I'm a best. I knew I was going to invest about $30,000 in it. And yes, I am getting a beer. The, uh, I, I, I knew I was going to invest 30000 bucks into this thing. I knew I was going to invest ten, twelve thousand dollars into the castle right up front, but the purpose of doing that was, I also called out every troll who had ever followed me who swore to God they kicked me out of a kingdom, and I knew they were going to come with vigor. OG came in here, dropped five thousand dollars in seven days, and got his ass handed to him uh, over and over and over again by a C twenty six and a C thirty. The, uh, and simply because he didn't know he needed to kill threats. Yeah. Meanwhile, but now he's like old hat threats. now, though, isn't he? Yeah, he's gone. Somebody else owns his castle, and uh, I like her more than everything. But she shit talks me, and I still don't care. She's not. She's not a lady. The uh, who she is. She's one of them Italian girls that was playing around with them. <laughs> the uh, I just I don't know why I know you said Italian, but in my head I heard Maldi Italian. Oh, yeah. Now the Italian girls. I don't know why. He, 
didn't get it. Hold on. The, uh, the, he didn't get his, it's like, how dare I leave this room without my treat? The, uh, my wife, my, what? Life, left the, my life left the beagle You forget we can't see you. I know. Yeah, I can't even see your screen, so when you're talking about what's on your I don't have a screen. camera up or anything like that, but the beagle walked in here, and, uh, he's not leaving the room without a treat. That's, that's all there is to it. Oh, okay. <laughs> my, my cat's <laughs> been harassing me. Up, sassy. <laughs> The uh, okay, so yeah, the uh, and then we had Zed, who they tried to tell us was Escher, who built up out of nowhere, and then just flopped over dead. Now we got Ivan, and I actually like Ivan. The uh, I, they they all these people that are mouthing off me think I got some hateful vengeance thing for them, or I'm, I'm trying to seek their respect or love, and I, I I don't give a damn. It's it's just you are what you are, and I have to deal with you for who you are. The, uh, they, they don't concept that they probably care more than I do. At the end of the day, we're over there testing shit and trying to work stuff out to benefit other people on how to play yeah. the game. They're not actually yeah. hindering the process. They, 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 they sneak it like today Ivan snuck They were hindering it. my process, which is why I went incognito for a little while, but yeah, I'm okay now. I, I, <laughs> Ivan snuck in there and hit me today. Now, I wish I'd have been in combat gear when he did it, but he snuck in there to hit me while I was in, in, in test gear. I leave myself unbubbled in case somebody wants to mega rally. I've been begging somebody to mega rally me in this kingdom for well over two months. Uh, d just because I need the stat report. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, we were talking about it before, weren't we? We were saying that we needed that stat report so that we could start working out how to set up our rallies. And... Uh, yeah, it's... So that we could I'm, figure out tower holding and stuff. But I think tower holding is going to be piss easy now with this like new inventory set up and these new guards and everything. We're not going to broadcast that live, but we're going to do something different that hadn't been seen done we're, because it requires TeamSpeak to do it. And, that, and we're going to have to move. I'm going to try and close a gap down of what used to be 11 minutes for reactivity to where we're trying to close a contact point down to 12 to 15 seconds. I don't even know if it can be done because everybody kind of flakes in and out. They're not paying attention to their devices. We'll see. Uh, the uh, I'm hoping this Dex, 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 that show enough <laughs> talked about at DEX. That, yep. that you put your you put your phone in. It allows you to put your stuff up on the TV. You got controllers and things, and it says it's. 50 times faster than any other interface. It's faster than your phone itself. Uh, we'll, we'll see. Takes, yeah, we'll see. If it can take some of the delay out, I'd be really, really happy about that. Uh, the uh, So I, I, I've ordered two of those, one for me, one for my wife to play with. She has her own game she plays. The, uh, but having that ability to broadcast, just if she can set it down on the phone next to the desk and blow it up on the TV, that would be fun. The, uh, so we'll see if that works. If it does, we'll show everybody it working. But first I test before I say yes or no. It'd be easy to say, hey, here Yeah, it yeah, is. we, we go, have to do go, tests. Go to my, yeah, go to my Amazon link. I don't tell you crap if it don't work. Because uh, you won't It's the same with our, with like our March theory. It all needs testing. Like we, yeah. really, we need 80 books. We can't do 80 books at the moment. So the baseline is, is 40. But the idea is that you have the top tier 40, of whatever march get, it is yeah. that you're building. You have that one maxed out on yeah. your war books, obviously. And then 80, you 80 have the same the, for inventory as well. Yeah, 80 being the two tier system. Yeah. Uh, I am. 50 and that you have the, was it Iron Will to start off with that we said? No, it wasn't, was it? It was for distance I'm talking about. We're going to be... Which one was the... Adds 12% of your distance defense. I got 51. So I'm I'm 29 books away. And the reason I'm not just spam buying them is, mm. guys, I'm, I'm a tight ass. I, I, I'm going to wait for the next event where I can get some free loot out of buying them. But ideally, what you're looking at for a, from the war book side of it, for a full distance march, you're looking at having distance... Um, whatever your top tier is maxed, Iron Wheel maxed, Cannons Devastation maxed, and then the the three of the same for infantry as well. And you Everybody have that, a percentage of infantry in your distance ever, march. And you do the same again for um, cavalry. 
everybody just saw me instantly open and click build a book. That's because this shit ass interface we were just talking about. Now Look at that instantly... beautiful face on your screen, Arlen. <laughs> you son of a bitch. <laughs> I was trying to my bottle. I've got good teeth. They won't pick it up. <laughs> 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 Hold the bottle closer to the camera. <laughs> it's about distance. It's about the uh no, just won't do it. There's no beer for you. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> <laughs> we have such a love hate relationship. Yeah. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> like, like, I got other friends. I can burn <laughs> Still got wonky. Still got wonky. Oh, poor wonky. Yeah. Yeah, poor wonky. Yeah. yeah. Oh, and back to what I was saying before, before the um, picture bomb, uh, is that if you're building an infantry march, you need either distance or, or cavalry in there as well to be able to benefit from those right. rule books depending on what, whatever you have first whatever march you're building first it doesn't really matter what it is the uh yeah it's but we'll get it uh, uh, yeah we'll get it down to two tiers and there is some benefit in the lower tiering of the old marches that we've seen before but it's not like before and it would no. require a whole crap load of war books so there's going to be the starter edition they optimize for your tower stuff because these are these supposedly war books go down in your tower, which I've never seen any proof of that <clears throat> because they don't show you the extra damage and stuff on a stat report. So if it ain't on a stat report, I don't believe for a second that it's actually happening. But uh, they say it does, and the they <laughs> are always from anonymous room. I have taken the they class, and the they class is how do you lie to anybody who asks you a question? Yeah, but that's why it's our job to figure it out. Yeah. Like, uh, we need to... I, I, I'm literally clicking on the helmet. Oh, there, I got it. Oh, this, this crap, this You're crap not supposed... interface. Crap interface, just pissing me off. And then if you haven't figured out that the rare Splendor gear, you get two pieces from the Oral thing, and you get the rest of it from the Honor event... And basically, you thought spending $100 was a bunch. We're going to make you buy it again. They could have not pissed people off if they had just had gems put into your regular gear that did the same thing they wanted to do by getting the money. Or if they it wasn't like two goddamn weeks apart from each other. Yeah. Yeah, so it's – they could have not pissed people off by just – no one I ever met was upset with the $99. That was always the $99 Splendor Gear. That's the best investment you'll ever make in this game. And they just made it. God damn it, I got to buy the $99 gear and got to buy more shit to put on it. The uh, good job at marketing over there in China. Piss off your customer and wonder why your revenues go down. They oh. can't win, though, either way, because if they do it the other way, then they're accused of being tailored towards the spenders. If they do it the other way, then they're not being efficient enough because they're getting they, shit if, away for free. If they'd, inter if they'd introduced the gems the same way they introduced it here, that those gems only go into Splendor, so you had to have the Splendor to use the gems, right? Yeah. And they, they, these are Splendor enhancement gems. Instead, I turn around, if I win the same piece of rare splendor in the uh, honor event, then I dis I dismantle it. I can only build the same piece that I won. So w the money I spend on honor becomes this gambling event. Oh, yeah. Now. You can't reuse the ingots. There's quite yeah. a few things that are similar to that. They well, need to fix There's a lot of different ways they could have done it, right? They could do it the same way they do normal gear, where yeah. you can't upgrade to rare splendor unless you already have a splendor yep. piece. Yep, that would have worked. The uh, there was a lot of ways of doing it, but I think that they could just put some put a gem out like that. No one went, and then they gave away the free stuff they gave away that only fit in there, or the gear they only gave away. Everybody would have been tickled with the free shit they got and been working on the stuff in the back of their mind without being upset that they're working on it. The uh, you know, it's they they don't realize it's not just upset on day one. 
it's upset every time they have to buy one of those keys now on it. That the reason they're buying that key is for a piece of gear they already own. The, uh, and eventually, some pe- and most people are going to start talking to other people and screw it. I only need the four. Yeah, I yeah, by, I, I, I do agree. With if that. I get it by, if I get it by luck, oh well. I'm not, you know, I'm not, I'm going to spend what I spent before and not a penny more. If I get yep. free crap, great. I'll be one of those people. Yeah, and I think that's where a lot of people. Are. <laughs> I will. I'll be one of those people. Thank you very much for my few pieces of splendor. I will wear that with my opulence. Thank you very much. <laughs> <laughs> I will, a hundred percent. I ain't buying shit. I love when people are such Jews at God that they're not even good at being a Jew. They don't even spend the money or to get gear that will help them spend less later because they have to spend on it. Yeah, just don't spend anything at all. Yeah. Except for all your resources. Yeah, that's fine. But I, I, I just work twice as hard for those. <laughs> yeah. All right. I think we co- I mean, we at least started the conversation. So down in the comments below on here or Creed's video, this video will be on two places. Um, and like I said, check around. I will have links on RogersRaiders.com of some 50% off events coming up that will be coming up shortly. They are not endorsed by GOG. This is because you guys follow us. So make sure you follow both places if you want to make sure you're being notified. And do note that just because you click the follow button on YouTube anymore, YouTube does not notify you when we put videos up. Yeah. Uh, also, they took the notification system down months ago. Uh, me and Gun wanted to know if there would be Gun a demand no for some literature explaining um, the new sort of war books and troop formations and stuff. And if it was something that people wanted then we would make it available on guns yeah. website i will host that we'll host that stuff and so yeah, we need you guys to let us know if that's something that you would want us to do we're not going to do the dirty work of making a paper for four guys that's that's just what she's saying there if, if, if a bunch of you guys down there want to tell us that you want a piece of paper so you know what the interactions of these war book stuff is that's a lot of work this video is me leaning back drinking a beer. The uh, <laughs> <laughs> documentation stuff that I used to do on one of the graders, that ain't leaning back drinking a beer. I gotta actually use a pencil at some point in time. The uh, gotta go buy a pencil, gotta buy paper. <laughs> yeah, my gosh, Your the investment. Ass hand around the pencil. Yeah, get the arthritis freaking under control. Duct tape it to you. <laughs> I catch myself now hat. where. It, you ever seen those old people where all four of their fingers are wrenched up as they're trying to hold something? Yeah. I I have to do that now. I, I I've got that dodgy little I'd say just use your toes, but you're losing those too. Those, those oh, let's not off. talk about his feet. Let no. no That's for another day. Take, cut them things off with hedge clippers. That's for another day. Uh, and I got to take this call. So. No, I don't. No. The, the uh. All right. What else do we miss? I think that's it. We didn't talk about Reagan. We didn't talk about Reagan. <laughs> Stop. We didn't Don't about encourage what it. What happened during the real Thanksgiving? Not one time. We haven't talked about the Celts. And how Creed doesn't even know her own history. Oh, we need show enough for that. I'm gonna bring show enough. We're gonna do we're gonna do some freaking politic and because the politics that we we repeat in the game or the politics that we know from our country. No, if you want to watch me turn into a real life fucking she devil, it's not happening. I can't I can't I can't discuss politics with anyone. Sure enough. Sure, sure enough, sure enough sure enough's like deep in your guys' history. He's <laughs> something else, man. He is something else. The uh alright. So we got stuff coming up guys. I appreciate it. Uh, this has been Arkin. Arkin, this has been Disappointing Turtle. This has been Arkin and Admiral Arkin. Admiral Arkin. Admiral Arkin. He's, he's <laughs> our... Downgraded from General. <laughs> <laughs> it's an upgrade from Reverend, though. They're the same rank. It just sounds better. Uh, I actually do agree. Sing, has more sing to it, Admiral Arkin. 
I was thinking about that today on my on my drive back. I'm like, man, we've had General Arkin forever, but General Arkin doesn't sing. Admiral Arkin, that's got a little class to it. You know, same rank. But yeah. Sings you, fear into the heart of every Rusky. They, 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 <laughs> I'm gonna, you can start getting cliches like, I'll write this ship, or I'll ram my boat where it doesn't shine. You know, you get all these new cliches going. Any part uh, in the storm. <laughs> Any part in the storm. That's how shy I got pregnant. <laughs> Next show. <laughs> we They don't allow us to do that show. <laughs> Degenerates. <laughs> All right. Thank you, guys. <laughs>